Good morning and welcome to the second meeting of the Pow of Inchaffrey Drainage Commission Scotland Bill Committee in 2018. The only item on the agenda today is to consider a recent written submission from the promoters of the bill following the oral evidence session at our last meeting on 24th January 2018. Members will recall that at the last meeting on 24th January, the promoters acknowledged that the land plans submitted by them when the bill was lodged are not accurate. These plans fundamentally underpin the bill by showing the benefited land and therefore who should pay towards the upkeep of the POW and it is therefore critical that they are as accurate as possible. The meeting clarified two possible options for next steps. The first was that the promoters would commission Savills to redraw the land plans using all the available information, plans from 1846 and 1848 and two books of reference and valuation from 1847 and 1851. The promoters also stated that we would try to gain access to a plan from 1851 which they had not seen but which was held by the National Records of Scotland. The second option was that a complete new reassessment of the land be undertaken and the promoters were going to meet with the Association of Drainage Authorities to explore the viability of this option further. The promoters stated the, that they would write to the committee once they had decided which option they wished to pursue. We have now had a written submission from the promoters which confirms that following the meeting with the ADA they have concluded that the second option would be prohibitively expensive and unnecessary and that the best way forward would be the first option that Savills be commissioned to redraw the land plans based on all the available information. The submission includes a note of the meeting with the, uh, with the ADA, as well as me a memo from Johnny Willett at Savills, which confirms that the 1851 plan, which is actually from 1850, has now been accessed and can be used in the preparation of the new plans. The submission also comments on the dollary land issues and asks the committee for a view and confirms that the promoters are content for the bill to be amended to allow up to three Balgowan section commissioners giving a total of nine commissioners and a quorum of five. And further, that RPI is the proposed index for linking the budget in terms of the right to appeal an index-linked annual budget in excess of £60,000. The committee will now turn to address the points set out in the paper. Firstly, I'll ask whether the committee has any views on the pr promoters proceeding as uh, proposed in commissioning Savills to redraw the land plans based on the available plans and books of reference. I think that's a very positive way to go and to move this forward. Mm. We agreed. And are we content to invite the promoters to um, submit the new plans and explanatory report to the committee, if possible, by 6th of April? which will allow time uh, for preparation. Yeah. Agreed. Content. Okay. And regarding, uh, as the committee paper notes, uh, to invite the promoters to submit in the explanatory report the new plans with the details as listed in the report, yes. are we content? Content. Um, regarding the issue of the dollary lands, it would be my opinion that it is not for the committee to make a determination on that issue, but for the promoters. Do any members wish to comment? I think you're absolutely correct yeah. with your opinion. I would agree yeah. with you. Okay. And on the promoter's willingness to allow for free Balgowan section commissioners, um, do, does the committee have any views? It's a sensible way forward and it's, it's, it's what the residents have asked for, so mm -hmm. it's a good approach. Represents the progress. And regarding the promoter's intention to use RPI um, to index link the budget for the purposes of an individual right to appeal an annual budget in excess of £60,000. I agree that approach. I also agree. Okay, are there any other matters that the committee wishes to discuss in relation no. to the paper? No. Okay. Well, I'd like to thank uh, members for um, attending today and the clerk will communicate the outcomes to the promoters. Uh, the next meeting will be determined in due course and communicated on the Parliament's website. And the next meeting will be to consider the new, the new land plans and the accompanying draft report. I now close the meeting.